Okay, now some questions on whether the explosion of the West plant may have caused ammonia to spread throughout the air. Marlena Hamilton right now is live to tell us, is this going to be a problem in our area and is it going to spread across the state of Texas? Marlena. Now we're told most of the injuries around the West plant were from the blast, not from inhaling the chemicals. Anhydrous ammonia can cause burns in the nose, throat or skin if inhaled. But we are told the fire mostly killed the ammonia when it hit the air. Trinity Clinic trauma surgeon Luis Fernandez says most likely the injuries are from the explosion, not the ammonia. Last injuries, debris, you know, shrapnel, whatever from that was that exploded, and probably direct. Some so those people that are close enough to the shock wave because the shock wave dissipates as it goes out. If you're close enough to the shock wave, you don't even have to be hit by anything. The shock wave can cause internal organ injuries as well. For more on this story, visit our website at ktknbc.com. Reporting live in the News Update Center, Marlena Hamilton, KTK News.